If anything like me, you'll need no convincing about the harm movies have done to morals in our country. But if the cinema is powerful to do harm, it's powerful also to do good. My name is Fire Pascal, and I'd like to talk to you today about how movies can actually help people. At the height of his career, film director Frank Capra developed a nervous condition which brought on a fever. One day when he was on his sick bed, a mysterious man came into the room and spoke to him these memorable words. Mr. Capra, you've been given a great power. You can speak to millions of people for two hours in the dark. Use that power to do good. And from that moment, Capra went on to make more meaningful films. As a teenager, I went to see a classic Christmas movie in a theater in Boston. It was a sentimental story with a good guy protagonist, and I remember coming out of the theater with a great desire to become a better person. Imagine if we could make films that would inspire people to come out of the theater saying, I want to be a better person. Over the years, I've read and heard about many people who have been influenced, reaffirmed, even converted by good movies. Here's one. The Italian director Franco Zeffirelli received many letters of thanks for his film on Jesus. One of these came from a young Japanese woman who had decided to commit suicide. Before doing it, she just happened to sit down and turn on the television. Jesus of Nazareth was on. The movie inspired her. She finally realized her life had meaning. Together with her letter of thanks to the director, she included in the envelope the pack of sleeping pills that she had bought to take her life. The great thing about movies is that they can reach people who will never hear a sermon or read a religious book, and there are many, about six billion. So the next logical question to me seems to be, if movies can bring about so much good in the world, why is it we aren't seeing more Catholic movies being made? Why is it our separated brethren are making so many more than we are? And with no small profit, War Room was made on a budget of $3 million and it brought in $73 million. Fireproof was made for $500,000, a half a million, and it brought in $33 million. So why isn't the Catholic Church doing more to produce good movies? Dear brothers and sisters, you and I are the Catholic Church. When I was living in Rome, my superiors entrusted me with a mission the Apostolate of the Cinema. In the words of Blessed James El Berione, the Apostolate of the Cinema is the most difficult of all, but it must go forward because God wills it. And I would add that God wills it especially in our times, when digital technology is opened up to everyone, the realm of independent filmmaking. Divine Providence has given to our generation the possibility of reaching the whole world with the powerful art of the cinema. Now it's up to us to make use of this means to spread the gospel. I'd like to ask you to visit our Memorare Pictures website, where you can learn more about our work and how you can help us rise up to the need for good Catholic films. Let's make movies that matter for the glory of God and the benefit of so many viewers. With your help, we can make it happen. Thank you.